Time now for that most accurate forecast here on this Monday. I'm meteorologist Iris Hermosillo. Powerful cold front sweeping across our state yesterday. and We're really feeling that cold air this morning with freeze alerts for much of Arizona, including for the valley. A freeze warning in effect this morning. And then these alerts will once again be in effect tonight into tomorrow morning as temperatures get really cold in the overnight hours. It'll be cool during the day too, but in the overnight hours, those lows will dip down into the upper 20s to low 30s around the valley. And then in those areas in the darker blue, that's a hard freeze warning where temperatures could go as low as the mid to upper 20s for lows. We also still have winter weather alerts. It's for that northeast packet of our state only through the early morning up near Window Rock as a few lingering snow showers are possible there behind that storm system that brought the cold front across our state on Sunday. And wind alerts remain in effect for northwest Arizona through this afternoon. Areas right along the Colorado River where gusts will be increasing to about 45 miles an hour as those winds come in out of the north and essentially pick up speed as they funnel down the Colorado River. Those are the areas where the wind alerts. Otherwise, those winds are starting to ease up across that, the state as that storm system clears off to the east. Again, a few snow showers possible in that northeast pocket of our state through the morning in the White Mountains too, but otherwise clouds will be thinning out across northeast Arizona. We're already clear across central Arizona and we're going to stay mostly sunny today, but we aren't going to warm much as today's temperatures are still going to be pretty chilly behind that storm system. After lows in the 20s to 30s this afternoon, Phoenix and across central Arizona, we're talking highs in the low 50s. That's it for Phoenix, a high of 53. Today, Flagstaff only reaches 29 for a high, so we won't even make it above freezing there. That'll be the case in Heber, Shello, and Window Rock, too. Then tonight, another very cold night with temperatures in the single digits in spots like Flagstaff as low as 2 degrees, but we could drop below zero at the Grand Canyon and in Window Rock tonight. And for Phoenix, another cold night, too. That low down to 34 degrees, 20s for Casa Grande, 20s down in Tucson, and we will stay very cold going into our Tuesday morning. Again, it's all thanks to that storm system. We've already Already got our eyes though on our next one. It'll move our way by Thursday and it's likely going to bring some more snow showers to northern Arizona. Another two to four inches possible in spots like Flagstaff or Phoenix. Look for passing showers. Certainly a possibility, but most of us won't get much rain. It'll be less than a tenth of an inch too if we get any showers. All in all though, staying cool all week with highs in the 50s to low 60s, overnight lows in the 30s to low 40s.